Welcome back to the Hank Strange Situation, Lifestyles of the Locked and Loaded. Make sure to check out HankStrange.com. You can sign up for our email list and find ways to follow and support our efforts. Let's see here. Okay, so shout out to everyone who's joining us in the chat. Smash those thumbs up. Uh, let us know if you guys have questions. We'll get into stuff. Um, Babyface, what's up with you? I think I haven't seen you in like at least 24 hours. Uh, at, at most 24 hours yeah when was i on last what's today thursday i was on monday uh no uh, not, not, tuesday, much, not much tuesday tuesday there was, was no oh monday. that's right i was on tuesday yeah uh not much has changed since then uh the weather here in florida is is sucking but yeah we get used to it <laughs> yeah um it's too bad too because that whole spacex launch uh, you guys i'm assuming we're all nerds right now, I'm pretty sure. They were yeah. supposed to launch some more, some actual people at this time, right? Yeah, they were supposed to launch yesterday, SpaceX. Did it not happen? No, the rain. So, yeah, I mean, it, it's it's been off and on storming, and it's yeah. been crazy off and on storming, where, mm -hmm. like yesterday, I don't know if you spent, it with, had any time with your windows open, but yesterday mm -hmm. it went from, like, bright sunny to, like, thunderstorms, to bright sunny, to thunderstorms, like, twice in a day. It was mm -hmm. crazy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's, you know, that's a problem. I was actually looking at, um, I was looking at the, the whole launch thing and they scrubbed it and everything. And it was really interesting to me. I'm, I'm into space, you know, and SpaceX is like, this is going to be, if they can make this, I think it's going Saturday now. I don't know about it, the weather. If you had the ability, would you go to space? Me personally. Like, if, if somebody was like, hey, we'll stick you in a spacesuit and send you up to space for a week, would you do it? Yeah, I would do it. What about you, Shane? Would you really? I would go. I'd, ha I'd have to say yes. That's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. I would go. You yeah. Know? I mean, how could I – then if I don't, if I turn down that opportunity, I am not allowed to be sci-fi anymore. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah. right, man. Turn in your card. Yeah. Turn it in. And it looks You're so – geek anymore. Yeah, I, I encourage everyone to look at this now. Like the, I was looking at the live stuff when they literally took them out of the pod, and um, it's still a small space, but the spacesuits are smaller, lighter. Mm -hmm. It's not like it used to be. It's you know, it, it's on another it level. Looks, right? They look so futuristic now. It's like yeah. they look like modern futuristic. Yeah, we're getting ready for space force. Space force is gonna happen. <laughs> Why are you guys laughing? It's a thing. <laughs> so why does Trump know that we don't? And why did he make the Space Force? That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Space Force is awesome. Well, it's, I don't think it's going to be like uh, the James Bond movie Moonraker. No. Uh, but I kind of wish I wish it were. You know? I wish <laughs> it was like that. I wish we could look up to the, to the sky and go, there's a fight going up on, you know, going on up there right now. And in this lasers and it's awesome. I <laughs> wish we could say that, but we'll never be able to say that. I don't think it's ever going to be that way. What mm. I've, I've read things and I've heard people talk about space force and what its purpose is. And it actually makes a lot of sense. If it's just going to be, um, you know, a focused, uh, group or, or force for, I guess, sort of protecting our interests in space. And there's a lot of satellites up there mm -hmm. and a lot of, I guess, defensive, you know, advantages to sort of controlling that area. So mm -hmm. it does make a lot of sense to have some, you know, group, a force that's dedicated to that, whatever I mean, that looks like. We, I think we have, like, tactical advantage anywhere in the world because of our, like, satellite systems. Yeah. Like, the, the guys on the ground literally now have, like, panels that they can be like, oh, okay, this is where we're going. Like, it's pretty crazy. Yeah. And, and we're going to lose a tactical advantage if we don't at least occupy the moon. If we let China <laughs> occupy the moon, we're done. Okay, just not a, I'm not joking. This is for real. I mean, I mean really, they could, they could screw with our satellites. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. No, that's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. They could but set we up. we also need a big laser cannon up there. Yes, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we, we, there's no at way. At some point. There's no way in hell we can let China go there and set up lasers and stuff like that on the moon is there and start is, sniping is there any us rules are there any rules about because the, there's like rules about antarctica where it's like no country can go and claim antarctica it's like for research only are there rules like that about the moon where it's like no 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 no, no. you can't own so. the moon nobody owns the moon. oh no we're gonna own the moon 
Well, the U.S. is going to own the, the moon. moon belongs to America. <laughs> we already put a flag <laughs> on that flag biatch. Up there, man. That's yeah, right. that's right. <laughs> that's ours. <laughs> okay, we that belongs to us. We have to go up there and claim <laughs> it before China or India or someone else lands up there, and then it's going to be like a whole thing. Uh, Alaskan ballistic, Alaskan Alaskan ballistics. Excuse me. Gave us two bucks here. He says from Alaskan Alaskan ballistics. Ooh, if right I could, on. if I could say it properly. I don't know. I've got like Alaskan ballistics Tourette's or something like that going on. Uh, shout out to everyone. Make sure to check out HankStrange.com. You can sign up for our email list and find ways to follow and support our efforts.